What is happening, y'all? Welcome back to another day of Baldur's Gate 3. Gonna be uh, getting kind of an early stream going today. May end up doing a night stream as well, because I'm having a lot of fun with this. But where we left off, it is... We had rested, and it is now time to leave the camp and continue on our journey. So, we're over at the Emerald Glove, but I want to... I want to shoot over there real fast. Someone pointed out that we can get into that area. That door that we thought was locked. Apparently I picked up the key. So I got to figure out where to use it exactly. But we're going to go back down there and try to figure it out. Apparently they added a fun NPC that can resurrect people and allow respects and all sorts of stuff. So that definitely sounds... Like a, uh, a high priority acquisition. Here we go. Got some lunch on the way. Actually, I skipped lunch. I was gonna go out and eat. I was like, you know, maybe. Maybe we do some more Baldur's Gate. So I checked, and I do have it in, uh, in my keychain here. I have this engraved key found in the sarcophagus of a long-forgotten chapel. And that should get this door open. Alright, nobody walk. Let me, let me auto save. I want nobody walking on top of traps. We got a pasta coming. Chicken pasta. Hmm, maybe not. Don't give me trouble now. Oh crap. Cancel. Let me try. All right, now let's see. How would I use this? Making stains. Hmm. <laughs> no, like how do I how do I use the key? It should just unlock, but it's not. So instead, we're gonna try and lockpick it, I guess. Total bonus plus seven. He's gonna pull this off anyway. He should pull this off with a plus seven. Oh my god, are you kidding me? time we cleared it. So this just leads me outside. Okay, so there's really no reason to open that thing at all. It's for the other hallway. Yeah. between druid and vengeance i mean there is a paladin that you can pick up and a druid you can pick up and add to the party so honestly it's really just kind of whatever you're vibing with the most since you can pick up both members with haste is it this door it is that door okay sign of a struggle I wonder what was so subversive about their words that they commanded protection 
No, I didn't keep the gloves from fighting the goblins. Those gloves are a... Unless you have the, uh, the mark, the absolute mark, those gloves are bad. Which, I mean, you could get marked, but we're gonna avoid getting marked. What's in here? Well, cavern, we'll check that out in a second. Black. I want to hop down there. Must be the god they worshipped here. Can't say I recognize him. I've never seen this language before. Who was worshipped here? Go down the cave. Lever. Where does this take us to? A hatch. Which then takes us up to the chapel. Okay. So I couldn't imagine playing this on, on console personally. Like the amount of like camera manipulation and inventory management like that's that's a uh that's a lot that's a lot for playing with a controller So that ladder takes me out. All right, there's got to be something down here. I don't know how. There's an NPC you can recruit to the base that'll do respects. Maybe it's based on the. Maybe I need to pass the religion check. Curse to put my hands on everything. I've never seen this language before. Who was worshipped here? Hmm. Button. Open the sarcophagus. We'll get you the key. I'm the trap. Heavy oak door. Acting room, you'll have the opportunity to grab some treasure. Opulent chest that holds 20 gold. A book called On Death and Resurrection to the right of that chest. I didn't see a book at all. Sounds like early access stuff. Oh, wait, there's a button over there. This is the thing that's tricky is like, cause I'm holding alt right now to see everything but until I get now see I'll just now showed up something over there gotta be so you gotta you gotta comb everything man Advantage. Okay. All right. Um. 
Enjoy. Good damage there. Let's have a little fun. Let's go. No, I just don't have the resources for it. Shit. And his turn. Okay, um... Blessing is ready and good. I gotta spread out. We are we are way too tight on each other right now. Um Wrathful Smite. I thought I didn't have Bane prepared. Thunderous and Divine. Action, this can be a bonus action. I mean, God, this thing has 18. I might be able to just mm, be iffy. Lacerate, cleave. Frost. Reduce the target's movement. Mm. I don't know if I want it. I don't know. I think I just let this hit. I'm not that worried about a single ray of frost. Silence on Shadowheart. Can't cast spells silenced. Okay, so you need to die. That did not work out at all. Alright, concentration is down. down. Alright, who's the who's the one that's doing the silence right now? You. Yes? Concentration silence. Fuck the reduced movement. Um
action. You get a pommel strike in. Frost ain't gonna stop a rogue. Can't cast spells silenced. Pop. Bibbity pop. Well, magic missile is honestly insane. Like the fact that I can, I can move like, like just like, oh, I'm gonna shoot, shoot, shoot. That's that's so good. That is so good. If I remember, I used to cast spells, recharge once per long rest. Damn. All right, so I mostly want to focus on cantrips. Cunning action. Bye. Something good here. I hope. I think we take a short rest. Well, some rests better than none. You have problems in trying to save the game? No, nothing. in the chest. Amulet of Lost Voices. Speak with Dead. Level 3 Necromancy spell. Uh... How delicious. Something the matter? No, I didn't. Um, I did not mean to click that. What now? the guardian of tombs through knowledge comes atonement Looking pretty good for a dead guy. So he has spoken, and so thou standest before me. Right, as always. What a curious way to awaken. Now, I have a question for thee. What is the worth of a single mortal's life?
curiosity. Nothing more. Wilt thou answer my question? So, I ask again, what is the worth of a single mortal life? I am curious by what standards thou shalt judge. Very well. I am satisfied. We have met, and I What's know up, Kitty? my face. We will see each other again at the proper time and place. Farewell. Haunted One, unfamiliar familiarity. <clears throat> Release withers from his tomb. My mind and well in it. Very well. I haven't tried <clears throat> I haven't tried playing on Steam Deck, but I saw one post where someone said it didn't run very well. I can't corroborate any reports though. I would like I said this is this is a game that I would play on PC only just because the amount of clicking and inventory management and dialogue I mean, I tried playing uh, Divinity on Switch for a while. It's just, I don't know, man. These games are just, they're, they're so much better on PC. Shadow Heart, level up. Okay, let's see. Prepare spells. Um, oh. We did have her loaded up. What do we got now? Aid. Heal your allies and increase their hit points by a maximum of five. That sounds really good. Mm. All damage and a plus one bonus to their armor class and saving throws. And be charmed or frightened. Hold person. I mean, the whole person is pretty busted. Heal all allies you can see. Can only be used outside combat. Wait, this this is insane though. Level two evocation, and it doesn't it doesn't use up a. Uh, it's a level two spell. If I use this outside of combat, would this use up? Hmm. Spiritual weapon. We just saw how brutal silence can be. I mean, if I was to use... I don't know. Chat, what do you think? Silence seemed pretty nasty. I'm thinking I could combo that, like, grease into silence. But spiritual weapon would definitely help protect her. Prayer of healing for just a fat heal outside of combat would save me on needing to rest. And then there's the whole person, but that's a concentration. And I feel like concentration, I'm usually going bless or bane. Rewarding bond. I 
I do have my dagger cloud. Spiritual weapon gives her a movable bonus attack action. I mean, the thing is, she's not really getting into range of people, though. For the most part, she is, is chilling in the back line. Also, so we have Cure Wounds and Healing Word. Maybe I, I drop Cure Wounds and I replace that with Prayer of Healing. So then I'm healing stuff I can see and big heals outside of combat. There's also 8, but a straight 5 healing. Yeah, I'm think I'm leaning towards Silence. Because I just got hit by that. The thing is, like... Silence is going to be OP against me, because my group's usually always together. But in fights, stuff is usually spread out. You have to go silence for now. You're an arcane trickster? It's whack. Cantrips. Uh, what do we got? Acid Splash, Bone Chill, Poison Spray, Ray of Frost, Shocking Grasp. I don't think I'm going to keep him in the party. I'm not a big fan of arcane trickster. Maybe I should grab dancing lights just so I can see in the dark. We'll go Poison Spray and True Strike, I guess. Sleep OP. Um, Mind Creatures. Add a wizard spell? Shit, magic missile. Or a second person that could cast Grease could be useful. Magic missiles. No, I already have a bow. Let's go Grease. Yeah, I mean, I don't, I don't, see, I don't need him as an arcane trickster. Um... I think I need some socks. Hang on, grab it. Short term amusements are much less hassle. What game am I looking forward to next? Armor Core, obviously. Cozy's warm. All right, let's go over. What's next? How do I get back into the camp? I don't care for fish. Red means now. That's a different. Matter. There we go. They're opening it. I was like, let me in, please.
could speak up. Let's see if his inventory has refreshed so I can just sell all my wares. Well met. Is there anything you need? Act fast if you do. Just some bits and bobs I no longer need. They have. Okay. Is there a... Um, I want to do... There should be like a sell all wares. How do we how do we sell all wares? Let me see. We don't even know these people. That sell all wares. Talk of the barter option. Uh, top the trading screen. Then select sell wares at the bottom of the screen. Do y'all see sell wares anywhere? I don't see sell wares anywhere. In the barter tab, you can select sell all wares. Also filter your inventory by various items. Go to the trade tab. Ah. Beautiful. That works. Thank you. Alright, so what do you have? Missile snaring. You can intercept missiles from ranged weapon attacks, reducing their damage by 1d10 with your dexterity modifier. That's kind of nice. I don't think I really want to buy anything else. Once for short rest, you regain a level one spell slot when you land a critical hit with Spell Thief. That's kind of cool. So but I think that's only if I'm using him as more pure range. Let's get wild. Give me a best shot. Not bad. Again. I can't do it. I'm not like you. Umi, I don't need you to be like me. You just have to buy enough time to run. Come on. I believe in you. You can do this. Kind words in unkind times, my friend. Well met. The Blade of Frontiers at your... The man's smile bends downward. And his thoughts become yours. You also have you a word. The blade of frontiers racing through the wastes of Avernus. Just ahead, a diabolical figure. Red you only need one dice roll to steal gold. Horn, See that? <clears throat> Buy everything I want and then steal the gold. That's the play. Hell's great fires. You were on the ship. Better friends than the ones hitching a ride in our skulls, at least. I'm sure you know the stories. Doomed to shed our skin and become a lithid. They say there's no coming back. But we haven't sprouted any tentacles. Not yet, anyway. Could just be good luck. I'm not so... Your minds collide once more. Will chases the fiend ignited with rancor. She is an infernal war devil. A threat to the living. Evil incarnate. Shit! You saw her. Advocatus Diaboli. I'm no stranger to the Infernal. Better to slay a devil before her fires burn common folk to ash. Her name is Karlak. An archdevil soldier I swore on my good eye to kill. I tracked her through the hells to the Mind Flayer ship, but the damned Elithids infected me before I could end her. She's out there now, preying on the innocent. I don't kill her. She'll leave behind nothing but a trail of corpses.
An excellent suggestion. But your party's full up. Still, when the time comes, call for the blade. I won't be long to answer. A splendid plan. We'll talk more there. Okay, you got him in the party. Do you know, can we go to the camp without resting? Or is the camp always a rest option? Okay, we're gonna do that, but first... All right, let's try it. Let's try and be sneaky. Let's see here. Well, hello. Let's go to the shadows. Don't linger. Very, very quiet. Need anything else? All right. Of course. But please, remember. It doesn't matter. Of you're course not the only one in need. You would choose strangers So, I would us. buy that. That's not what I said. Can you stop shouting? Get that. Buy that. Sylvanas be with you. Arrested for theft. If you have a defense, make it now. We're gonna reload. We need. <clears throat> I'm trying to remember. How do I do into? I need to like lock him in dialogue and then steal. Okay. Here we go. Steps. Never a dull moment. So not for communal use, it seems. Best shows. Need anything else? Of course. But please. Okay, so we were gonna buy that. The heavy armor, and then um Oh no, I can't afford that. Alright, instead of that we'll do the No, I do want that. And then I can do Split item. Why is it not? It's not splitting. Whatever. Sylvanas, be with you. Trust no one. Calm down, please. I won't leave them behind. You need anything? I don't know if I can. If I can do this. Uh, Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be able to I don't think I can pickpocket from him. I think it's too it's too light there. Cause I was trying to do the old the, the divinity trick where like you lock <clears throat> one dude talks to him, the other dude comes behind him and steals, but that doesn't seem to work, so that's fine. We don't really need to we don't need to steal. Yo, I did switch to Asteria and we were getting discovered. Like What's up for discussion? Thanks for fighting off those goblins. If you need to replace any gear, just ask. My selection's pretty slim. I had to leave most of my equipment in Elturel. Well, Only 88 for a crossbow? Would I use it that much, though? Um, 
Need to keep him in dialogue. Oh, fuck, see? What is he doing? <clears throat> he just walked into his range to try and pickpocket. Need anything else? Yeah, there's no, there's no way. That doesn't matter. Of course it does. You would choose strangers over us. Need anything else? No. Shouting? Yeah, I don't think I can get this guy. There's, there's, it's, he, his whole back is red. How much further can I go? Is that moving? Something only I know. Make one up. Collector of valued objects. To talk. Whoa. Hey. Go on. Take this ring. It's lucky. Call it. Heads or tails? Heads it is. See? That's the kind of luck you get from one of my lucky rings. Oh, my food's here. I've got more where that came from. Real cheap, too. Interested? You got it. One sec. That's what I got. Got potions and stuff. Nothing caught. You suddenly feel something moving against your back and turn. Lunge at her. Remorse or not, she tried to vibe you. Vengeance! <laughs> is this- is this too vengeancy? Mm. What would a vengeance paladin do to a pickpocket? <laughs> would he- like, is that over- I, I'm gonna grab my food. Y'all- y'all decide, is it overly aggressive? To grab the child.
You're basically meant to be akin to Batman. Catching them seems reasonable. Vengeance! How did that child escape? She would not have broken my grip. We got some pasta. It's good. Let my daughter go right now! She's a thief, hell spawn. And you will wait for Corga's judgment. Now get back! Oh, let me through, Rag Rashem, or I'll rip mm. your damn throat out! <gasps> Give him a chance. You, get back! Keep back! Force my hand and I'll show you its claws. A moment, Giona. What? Oh. I understand. You! Apparently Korga wants to see you. Go ahead. In the way. talking to tough fit topaz I don't see the person I'm supposed to talk to I want to see what's over this way. <laughs> Someone singing. It's beautiful. Siren? in shallow water just a slice of the ankle tendons <laughs> a sweet melody beckons you it vibrates with magic a harpy's charm
Ooh. I ain't letting that shit hit. gonna do advantage hit on me um harpies probably don't like fire I'm gonna hit allies with this take a nap <clears throat> Last time. Smite! Pommel ah. strike. one's days. Let's kill you. Tell you what, sleep in the crit is dirty. He's doing some work, bro.
That seems not going anywhere. Dice am I running? 3d4. Damn. He's good, bro. He's good. Now it's my turn. Oh, 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 oh. Divine smite. Beat the shit out of that RP. Swift as my feet can carry. Are they gone? No. Yes. I mean. I don't know. <laughs> they're, they're gone. Now there's just Mole. She'll be so mad. I didn't get the gold from the nest. I got to go. Wait, um, you should meet Mole. She'll be grateful you helped me. Find a boy called Donnie. Tell him you want to see the dragon's lair. He said something about a nest with gold. What's hiding here? Time to press ahead. Gail has something interesting to say, it looks like. Scamp reminds me of myself when I was a nipper. Always getting into trouble. Comes with the territory. One time, my parents denied me a kitten, so I summoned myself a tressim. Oh, dear old Tara. Beautiful creature. Benefits of a wizard's education, you see. Of course, my considerable talent didn't hurt either. Well, that depends on who you ask, I suppose. I may have summoned things rather more exotic than a winged cat. Only when the occasion suits. That's mostly a synonym for yes, by the by. Anyway, I'm glad we got that boy out of his predicament. Poor lad would have been harpy feed if it wasn't for us. Yeah, Gail is definitely, I'd say in terms of, of uh, useful potential, Gail's looking really good. It's like, so if we, if we take a look at our characters so far, my dude just smited a harpy for like all of its health. Obviously awesome. Shadowheart? I mean... She, it doesn't feel like she's doing a whole lot, but, you know, she's throwing out some heals, which is nice. Uh, speaking of heals, let me, um, seal everybody up. She can, you know, she's, that's nice. Having somebody that can heal is very useful, and she's blessing us, so that's good. Asterion's ass is useless. I'm sorry, man. He is, all he's doing is he's like... Pew! Pop shot and shit with a bow for like two damage. I mean, he did get a sleep crit, but let's be honest, my paladin probably could have hit harder. But then you got Gale over here, who's just magic missiling the whole damn world to death. Literally, just like, oh, magic missile. Pew, magic missile. Pew. Dude is doing crazy good.
I mean, sneak attacks, yeah, I get it. It's just, I don't know. Oh, I got food on my shirt. I'm gonna eat it. I think Carlock is going to be in the party when I get her. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please. I'm sorry. This is madness, Korga. She's just a... A what, Wrath? A thief? A poison? A threat? I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. A death viper. You've not bad poison before. A single drop of it could kill that child in a heartbeat. We will speak soon enough. First, judgment must be passed. The parasite eats our food, drinks our water, then steals our most holy idol in thanks. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Teela is restless. Come, Korga. We took back the idol. Surely... Do it. The snake's hiss of approval reveals its intentions. God damn it, one of the noodles fell. Struggle. It is poised to strike. The death of a child. I'm gonna have to change my a shirt now. Timeless tragedy that never grows old. Oh, 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 barely, dude. Very well. I'll defer to your ruling. My circle has offered grace to these outsiders. We gave them shelter from storm. We nourished their bellies. In return, these devils lured in a horde of goblins. And their spawn stole the one relic that might keep us safe. We've taken back our relic. But I will keep the fiend caged till our protection right is complete. I... I was scared. They said when the right was over we'd have to leave. But there's goblins out there and worse. And it's nice here. So I... I took the idol. I thought maybe then we could stay. Please let me go. I'll be good, I swear. Well, Paladin, what say you? Hmm. Oh, she's dead now. Yes. Tila to me. Gone. By the gods, Korga, what have you done? Bury the remains. Continue the right. And the parents? They're just outside. This outsider will take word once I've spoken to him. We must focus on the right. 
I didn't kill her, bro. We're right back, though. I can't. I, I can't have this pasta shirt on. Only we'd never let the tieflings in. The child might have lived. You have Master Halston to blame for that. I can't believe he just left. He lost sight of what is important. We can't do the same. I got a good shirt for vengeance. See, it's, uh, it's Omni Man and uh, Homelander, and they're celebrating murder. Very vengeance appropriate shirt. Blood on your hands, cowboy. Go talk to them devil parents and accept their vengeance. Bro, listen. The child committed a crime see i was i was gonna actually so when we played this in early access i sided with the child but this is what i like a lot about this game is having paladin i open up the like i'm the arbiter of justice let me decide and by doing that we found out that they were trying to protect the kids and the child stole the idol nah man straight to jail Oh, they're protecting us, but they're gonna make us leave when their thingy's done. Let me steal their idol. Fuck that. Go to jail, kid. And it wasn't even like imprisonment for life. It was imprisonment until stuff is done. Seems like a good moment to talk. Go on. Say it. You think I'm a monster? First you urge grace, then you speak truth. You surprised me twice over. A shame the grace period ends. The viper's fangs have been bared. She must guard her brood. No matter. I took back the idol of Sylvanus, and the rite is resumed. We will seal the grove, free from harm, free of intruders. Then I was wise to grant you entry. And you'd be wise to heed my words. I want you to provide your services to the tiefling leader. Zevlor, he's called. Offer to guide the Outlanders out of the grove. I'm sure they'll reward you well. 
they're to be gone before final prayer. If they are not, the viper must strike. Come here. Oh. You will do more than speak. This tale ends but one way. With the Outlander rot cleansed, and the grove forever shrouded. Is there, do you chat, do you know if there's a, uh, let me try, I don't know. Is there a camera lock function? So I think it'd be fun since it's more role playing to like kind of have the camera like close up on the party and have it locked, but I don't know where that would be. Wait. Never mind, I just found it because I'm the best. I'm the ultimate gamer. A little more immersive this way, you know? We are not going to be an oath breaker. What? Hold up. Hold up. What? What oaths have we broken? What oaths have we broken? We have... We have... <clears throat> dished out vengeance when necessary. What about a bear? I'd like to keep our guts on the inside. What? Somebody, somebody tell me how I have broken my oath. Try grease and palms. Unless you have news of Arabella, I don't want to hear it. Wait, what? What are you saying? Don't be ridiculous. What are you on about? No. You're not saying. You're wrong. You're wrong. Bells! Stop her. We should have stopped her. I am the arbiter of truth. I will not lie to these parents. Now, where is this child that thought to pickpocket me? They must face vengeance! Is it worth getting this on PS5 or get this now on Mac? I don't have Windows, please help. I mean, does Mac even support this? Listen, I don't know shit about Mac. So I ain't gonna pretend to know anything about Mac. Let's hope we'll but, as I mentioned earlier, I prefer to play games like this on PC, 100% of the time. How long do you think we've got before the goblins come? Find Zor yeah, this is you. Should be getting drunk at least. It's no fun waiting for death sober. We should be getting drunk at least. It's no fun waiting for death sober. I mean, I think I'm supposed to find the Githyanki Kreesh. Find Zoru. This is Zoru. I probably maybe I need the the Githyanki lady with me. <laughs>
I've already heard Arabella, nine summers old, and now she'll never see another. Because of druid law, every natural law demands I take up my sword, storm their lair, and... But no, that's what Korga wants, to prove we are exactly what she says, a threat. I won't give her the satisfaction. I'll get my people clear of this, but on our terms. It's good of you to offer, but there's a whole army of goblins out there. We'd need an army of our own to escort us safely to Baldur's Gate. And while I don't doubt your abilities, you're no army. There may be a way, though. Goblins are ill-disciplined. It's unlike them to organize so cleverly. Somebody must be leading them, bringing discipline to their ranks. Take out that leadership, and they'll scatter. It's no small thing to ask, but I've seen you fight. You're equal to the task. I suppose so. We don't have much, but we'll scrape together whatever we can. Of course. Everything we have, anything we can give you, we will. We'll be ready to leave as soon as you give word. For the right payment, I will bring vengeance. Past those goblins, they'll find it. Yes, of course. Why is this a red ladder? That means I'm not supposed to take it. Probably. Where does it go? Used to think the goblins would kill us the second we set foot outside, but after hearing what you offers did, vengeance, some terms and conditions well, apply. <laughs> I still think they'll kill us, but at least we can put up a fight. Well, we came through Avernus. We might not look it, but we're tough. Who knows? Some of us might even make it to Baldur's Gate. <laughs> <laughs> there's optimism, and then there's stupid, hun. Plenty of us fell to monsters already. I don't see the rest of us lasting long out there. But if you're so sure we will, why not put a little gold on the line? I'm sure you're good for it. Just leave the gold on my corpse. After seeing you at the gate, I'm sure you'll last longer than us. Excellent. And since I ain't one to leave a debt unpaid, that means we're destined to meet in Border's Gate. Looking forward to it. She wants that dragon dick. Find Zoru. Find Donny. Let's go find Donny. And then what's, what's this one? This one's not showing up. right past you as if you're invisible or boring boring impossible he nods then reaches for a concealed hatch
I bet this is where that little pickpocket went. Well, look who's come to visit. My kids say you've been busy since you got here. Messing with our business. Yeah? You scared the life out of little Sylphie. Now, you're going to pay for it. You, you, you think that's funny? Fine. Laugh at this. I'll go tell the guards you're pushing us around. See you around, chump. Never see us coming. Do you children wish to die? I saved your friend's life. You did this to yourself. I don't get why these kids are being all snippy with me when I save the... I save Sylphie. We're gonna tell the guards. I will murder. No, I won't. I need to... That's... That's going... I can't go murder Hobo. I should. You speak poorly to me? Goblin. Hunt down Carlock. Let's go hunt down Carlock. The darkness. It compels me to murder! Yeah, right, the guards are gonna believe a bunch of bratty-ass kids. How do I get over to you? I want Carla. Goblins are way out there. I probably pass through and then go north. I'm gonna raise them kids, right? <coughs> we will bring back the children and then teach them morals. That is kind of a funny idea. Let's put on non-lethal and just beat them all into submission. You will learn, child. You said merely that if the eyes are the mirror to the soul, yours have dark turns across the mirror. No, it's not the Oh, you can practically smell the filth. People up ahead, something's wrong. You're a true soul, you can't die. Please stay with us. I don't think he's conscious. C can you hear us, Ed? You, not a step closer. A strange thing glows marked on their flesh, and something within you stirs in response. Nat 20. 
I'm so, so sorry. It's our brother, True Soul Edwin. He's injured, and I... I wasn't thinking. Something stirs deep within you, hungry and alert. It's taking something you'll never get back. The injured man locks eyes with you. The parasite writhes in your head. Useless. Your minds intertwine. You see his siblings, Andrik and Brynna. New recruits. Yours to shepherd. Protect them. Mind the true soul. He will... He... I don't think you could have made a less scary. He's not scary looking. He looks like strength. And, and justice. The absolute now. A true soul. Thank the absolute. Edwin, our brother. He was chosen, like you. Do you have orders for us? We were reporting to Edwin. What? Are you? Are you testing us? The absolute is our goddess. She's going to rip down the old world order, start a new one. Then we'll be the ones with the power. Well, you will firstly, true soul. You don't need me to explain that. A true soul, like you, has been chosen by the Absolute. You speak with her voice, and when the time comes, the true souls, you, will rule. That fellow had a tadpole in his head, and they consider him blessed? Chosen? Madness is this. I'm sorry, true soul. I only repeated what I thought I knew. It seems the absolute still has a great deal to teach me. We know that all too well, sir, but the absolute sent us here. We're looking for fugitives, survivors from that ship that crashed farther west of here. We don't know what they look like, but anyone who survived that crash is bound to be injured. That's enough to get us started. The Absolute wants them found. At any cost. You! Uh, Brenna! Kill him! Pretty good hit. Sacred flame. Oh, man! I will say, Shadowheart whiffs her attacks a lot. Firebolt, Mage Hand, Ray of Frost. High defense. What about versus this? Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Fell on his ass. go to waste. The tadpole has absorbed it all. Its experience could nourish you. 
strengthen you. Join me. You will live in my back pocket. So they were they were looking for uh let me see if there's a hotkey. Is there a hotkey to add to wares? Hold shift and left click an item. That does not work. See if there's a key bind. There's a hotkey for where's some people are saying shift left click but that doesn't seem to work for me or maybe I have to go to inventory no that selects everything I will say I like, I'm, I'm sure I'll find better stuff later, but I like how Divinity has like lots of crazy bonus stats you can get on stuff, whereas this, I mean I guess this is just more of a D&D &D thing, isn't there an Owl Bear in here? But the, uh, the stats are pretty, pretty vanilla for the most part. I mean, I don't need to go kill an owl bear, do I? I remember fighting this thing in early access and it being fucking brutal. And I have basically cantrips at the moment, and that's it. Let's have a look. Wait, I think you can. Hmm. Dead Albert prey, no doubt. Let's, let's just approach it and see what happens. Because I want to say you can approach it and, like, offer to help it or something. You feel the quake of its heavy footsteps before you see it. An owl bear, its beaked face looming out of the darkness. Wisdom. Puff out your chest and roar. Yeah. Let it know. I'm a beefy boy. Oh, fuck. Not like this. Roll again. Oh, no. Even worse. That's better. 
the beast shrinks back, feathers quivering. We should speak up. Oh, nope, combat started. Is there a way to undo movement, like have them run back from where they came from? Where's your, uh, where's your shit, bro? I don't have my, my army of knives thing. No, but I mean, I, it's like my some of the spells I equipped, I don't even have. I mean, we're probably not gonna. This is remote. There's really, there's really no reason to fight this thing. I think I would have had to, uh, I would have to rest. I'd have to get back my, that stench. my stuff. That's, that's one of the big things. I mean, it's just, I know this is how D and D works, but like, Pave my path with I really like how in, um, castle with bones. you know, in divinity, you have like a, a whole, oh yeah, let me check his spell book. Yeah, Cloud of Daggers. Spell is not prepared. What do you mean it's not prepared? Oh, I guess I learned it, but I didn't prepare it. Son of a bitch. I like how in, in Divinity, you know, I can rotate through all of my shit in combat. Whereas this is like, you know, long rest, short rest type thing. So it's, I don't know. I might end up, if there's like a mod where it's like, you know, you don't have, you don't, or, or like you get, I don't know. Infinite long rests or some shit. So I like using my abilities. And I get it. You're supposed to, like, you know, get through with cantrips and, and regular combat and use your abilities when you really need them, but that shit's not as ex exciting. She had it. Can I not get there from this swing? That would probably be the first thing I do mod wise, is just make it so I can use my abilities more frequently. for a druid. Yeah. Well, cuz I mean like, you know, like divinity you're you're opening up your you're opening up fights with like big damage and whatnot, but when you know, the idea of like, oh, I've done my smites, no more, no more smiting until I take a long nap, it's kind of like, 
You seemed quite forward with your compliments earlier. We'd only just I gotta figure out how to get. She's over here somewhere. A lot of blood. I feel like I can get a cross back over here. Let me actually see. Baldur's Gate 3 mods. Aerosalon Enhanced gear progression adds all generic 012 weapons and armors from files under the treasure table Including splint and plate types and new weapon types Yeah, that sounds cool add more gear This mod adds some legendary items to the game Yeah, I'd probably want that Shadow heart hair change Carry weight extra. I'd probably want that. That's 5e cantrips to the game. Well, a couple of the mods have been updated already. Hippity hoppity. Uh, are you guys not gonna? Diligence and care. Should mind my step. What are you? What are you doing, bro? I have no mods on right now. Wait, Carl, hold up. Yeah, Carlock is the lady. I think I need to have, uh, do I need to have Will in the party though, perhaps? Whatever killed those gnolls might be nearby. Careful. somewhere hmm. well hang on a second I gotta run to the bathroom real fast that lunch is tearing my stomach up I'll be right back
Whew. Bit too much balsamic in that pasta. Just had to... Just had to deliver some vengeance in the bathroom. Whew. Uh, respecting is a thing in this game, so you may be able to change the class. It does not rely heavily on long rests. I mean, it seems like most of them do. All right, where are you at? Open up. I ain't in here. It's mine now. Buckle. Take it. Take it. Take it. Oath of looting. Is she down below, maybe? Shit happened down here. Oh, what's going on? Grab that rest. Oh, no. We're just going to reload that save. That was a terrible experience. It was like perception failed death 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 what death before me all right where where's where's uh where's tiefling barbarian mommy at she's supposed to be here Go back to the river. Something tore right through these people. They didn't stand a chance. The beautiful broken heap smells oddly enticing. You find you can't resist inhaling her offals. You hear what comes next before you see it. The sharp snapping of bones and a yelp of pain as her body starts to twist and undulate. You watch with cold realization. This isn't the end of one life, but the start of another. Her darling pups will not be of her own species. Knolls bring forth their iniquitous litter from many corpsed wounds, including hyenas. Bless the hyena and purge the body of evil. Or smite the abomination. Hmm. What kind of paladin flavor are we feeling today? I mean, I don't know anything about gnolls. Is it more venge vengeful to bless it and purge the evil or to smite it? This is a close poll. 50, 50, it's 51% right now. Smite pulling ahead, just barely. Oh man, this is close. Cast your vote now, chat. Are we blessing it or are we smiting it? Purge the evil, it's not the hyena's fault. You've done lots of vengeful, but very little paladin. <laughs> Bless is pulling ahead. We're gonna we're gonna stop at a hundred and it's like 20 votes. It's almost there. All right. 100. Oh, no. We're still going. All right. Let's go. 150 votes. That's the cutoff. Right now, Bless is pulling ahead. 15 votes to go. Could Smite catch up? Or are we blessing the hyena and purging the evil?
And at 150, Bless wins with 56%. Oh, fuck. That's a, that's a fail. That's a success. Slowly, her broken body starts to calm to stop its wild contortions. She lies still. Whatever horrific creature was growing inside the hyena dies along with her. One hyena, two hyena, three hyena, four. That hyena's making a break for it. You will not escape. Oh, fucking save. I should slow it down some. Sometimes the only way out is through. Trying to get away. Bonk it. Nope, fuck. She just got crit. Shit. A bunch of them. We gotta get into the cover so they lose line of sight. Yes, the grease is stopping them. Let's make this quick. Creator, destroyer. Fuck! Into the shadows. I 
That didn't work. Soul numbed? What the hell did it do to me? It's just gonna kill me, I think. Man, I don't know if I have the... Just whiffing. Night to King Five. Still on my feet. Time to press ahead. Enjoy acid. I think this is the kind of fight I needed a long rest but before doing. Hey, I don't think I can pull this off. gonna reload I think see but this is and this is kind of what I was talking about is like I feel like I need to go to camp because if I don't have abilities I don't think I could like if I had you know magic missile and smite and all that shit I think I could win this but not having anything and just having to like basic attack I don't think I can pull this shit off man uh, so where where is Carlock exactly what the fuck happened there? It's just, uh, it's weird. Y'all kept saying, just go get Carlock and then rest. Like, right, I'm down with that, but, like, where, where? I don't know where she's at. You said down by the river. I'm at the river. Is she, like, down here? Yeah, I don't know why you're comparing a CRPG and an action RPG. These are, uh, very, 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 very different games. You might as well be comparing, like, Diablo and chess. Mm 
go to the right. I mean, we're at the river, though. All right. What now? What does you want to talk about, Gail? Spare me a moment, if you please. I've something important to discuss with you. We've been traveling together for a while now, and it's just about time that I shared something with you. It's a rather personal matter that I'd have preferred to keep quiet, but needs must when the devil drives. I have no choice but to speak. You see, I have this condition. Very different from the parasite we share, but just as deadly. The specifics are rather personal, but suffice it to say that it is a malady I've learned to live with. Though not without some effort. What it comes down to is this. Every so often, I need to get my hands on a powerful magical item and absorb the weave inside. I'll spare you the finer details, but it begins with a simple biological deterioration, muscle spasms, disorientation, a slight ringing in the ears, and, if left for too long, catastrophe. It's been days since I last consumed an artifact, since before we were abducted. It is time, and by that I mean it's imperative that I find and consume strands of weave at the earliest possible juncture. We've already done the finding. In fact, you have one in your possession. You know for yourself how hard one such an item was, and it will be no easier when even more are required to assuage my hunger. Okay. There'll be danger involved, or great cost. Splendid. A bit of boldness will serve us well. As luck would have it, you're already primed to give me exactly what I need. Yep, no. Perhaps I'm not conveying the urgency of the situation. It's incredibly, world-shatteringly important you give me a suitable artifact. Please. You ain't getting my sword, bro. <laughs> you can fuck off with that. Of course. I hate for you to think me impatient or ungrateful. I shall persevere for now. There's a negative chance you're going to eat my sword. I have to keep going. All right, well, I'm down by the river. Where? Where is... Where, all right, let me just look up fucking Demon Lady. Carlock. Carlock. <sighs> this thing says fight your way through the blood on the ground and Carlock resting on the opposite side of the river. Well, we came from the opposite side of the river. Simply sitting on a rock at the end of the path known as Risen Road. Oh, fuck, she's right there, Jesus Christ. Me! 
Ricky. Never been better. Oh, fuck me. It's you from the Nautiloid. Please tell me I found you before those so-called paladins of Tear did. Now that's a story, and I'll tell it to you, but truth be told, we shouldn't stay here too long. See, these paladins of... A great heat roars through you, her heat, fiery as the hells. Then you're lost in visions of demonic armies, as you tear through a landscape of fire and blood. A blood war. You saw it from above as the Nautiloid passed through Avernus. This woman was on the front line. Mountains as far as the eye can see. Guess that explains the voices. From that peak I got into your head, you've made some inroads trying to get the thing sorted. But alas, no joy. I'm Karlak. And you are. Well met, soldier. Now that we're old pals, how would you feel about helping me kill some evil bastards? A little background. If your moral compass needs something to point at. You already know I fought in the Blood War. I was good at killing demons. Really good. So good, Zariel, the Archdevil herself, made me her personal attack dog. I played along until I could get the fuck out of there. It took me ten years to probably escape, but now I'm free. Zariel sent goon after goon to hunt me down. But believe me when I tell you, game is treating me going. quite good. The latest yappy little dog she sicked on me are nearby. A group of dopes posing as paladins of tear. Want to help me take them down? Fuck yes. They cornered me outside the toll house just up the hill. Doubt they've gone far after the scorching I gave them. After we've mopped them up, we can work on evicting this parasite and take Faerun by the short hairs. Sound good? You want to just team up with some blood-stained killer? Because I'm fine with that. I'd hug you if it wouldn't scorch your skin off. Hang on, though. Looks like what you would you say is the breakdown of dialogue to Towards gameplay? Um, I'll catch up with you when it's time to camp for now, but don't get to any of the. I would say. Got it. So far, my time has probably been like thirty percent dialogue, thirty percent combat, forty percent exploration. Map. Okay, for now, I kind of want to pull her and, um, and Wile into the party to see what happens. I knew we were a strange band, but a fugitive from the hills? <laughs> now that's someone worth knowing. Not that I want to get on the wrong side of any devils, but this Karlak is a survivor. Plus... I appreciate anyone who opens a conversation with threats of bodily harm. Oh, darling, I'm hurt. I thought we had something special. You look so goofy with the cowboy hat. I guess I'll spend my evenings lounging here while you do all the hard work. It sounds awful. Because I kind of want to... Uh, where's Shadowheart at? We're going to... We're gonna have Shadowheart chill here. I wanna bring the other dude along as well, just to see the interaction between him and Carlock. We may have to increase our camp provisions now that we have Carlock along for the journey. Those muscles don't run on fresh air, I'll wager. Still, she'll be useful in a fight. It 
If you're sure. Fine. I'll be here whenever you rediscover your taste in company. She's kind of snippy. I like that. What's inside? Mask of the Shapeshifter. Peculiar clothing chest. Ape of the Red Prince. Bicorn of the Sea Beast. Needle of the Outlaw Rogue. Interesting. I'm going to take that cape and put it on. Ooh. I guess this is like uh, pre-order stuff. Or is it just stuff for having divinity? I wonder if other stuff can go in the pack. Oh, hell yeah. Look at my cape. I'm badass dragon man now. And where's... I can't put that in there. Okay. Drink to gain the ability to fly. Because I need to figure out right now the biggest thing is figuring out a party. The blade of frontiers at your calling. That's the spirit. Demon mommy. Hey ya. Uh. Aces. And then Asterion had. I just need his inventory. You. I like it. Is there a way to just just check his inventory while we're at camp? Hang on. I think what I gotta do is grab her. Oh, come on. Oh. And then invite him, take his stuff, and then replace him. Because one of these might go good for a barbarian lady. Okay, um, she uses a great axe, 4 by 15 I could probably give the Watcher's Guide to Gale, maybe he'll eat that. Um, and where's, and where's, and where's. Uh, where did you go? Get, I mean, uh, if I gotta feed him magic items constantly, that's gonna get pretty annoying. Mind. Apart from finding me, that is most gratifying to hear. May I? Thank you. Magic, it's like a lullaby that sings to sleep the demon inside. A metaphorical demon, I haste to point out, but no less dangerous. And no less bound to wake up again to continue its ravages. Such is the nature of all monsters.
grateful as I am, the course of our camaraderie is much better served by not taking that particular detour. Not just yet. Sincerely, though, I understand I ask a lot from you with few answers in return. But in time, all will be told. Hmm. I obtained it in Waterdeep. Nothing there comes cheap. Okay. Wilds. Level you up. Okay. Spells. Kind of like the sound of that. Eldritch. Agonizing Blast. Add your charisma modifier to the damage it deals. I mean, my charisma is pretty high, so that might be nice. Kind of like the idea of repelling blast and agonizing, so I Elbridge blast and then I'm getting a charisma modifier and I'm knocking them back at the same time. Summon an imp or quasit or hey, let's do the tome thing. As for that, I don't even know if I'm keeping him in the party or not. I need a spell book. Sleep grease, chromatic orm. Put that on. Misty Step would be good. Would sleep is also pretty OP. Here, I haven't, I haven't even had a chance to use Chromatic Orb yet. Barbarian seems pretty straightforward. <laughs> Wild Heart. Isn't that like the, uh, like the, um, yeah, it's like the druid version of Barbarian. While Raging, you can use Unrelenting Ferocity and have resistance to all damage except Psychic. Dash as a bonus action sounds really useful. Primal Stampede, longer jump distance. Ugh. Hmm. I kind of like the dash bonus action, but like super. I think dash bonus action is going to be more valuable. Three enemies at once. 
But how often am I going to have three enemies together? <sighs> I'm going to get my stream pants. So we're going to do a pull here. So bear gets me healing. Eagle heart is the long jump and a leap strike. Elk slam a bunch of enemies and movement speed. And the last one I would consider, I'm not interested in wolf, but tiger would be jump distance and cleave. I'll vote real quick. I'll be right back. Bear is brutally good. Damn, yeah, Bear dominated the poll. Bear. I've got a long road ahead. Never wanted the easy path. Long rest. I'm definitely going to need a mod for just free long rests. Just to get my actions back. One horn, the stink of Avernus, Advocatus Diaboli. Well, I'll be God's damned. The Blade of Frontiers. Thought I'd shaken you for good. That'll teach me to underestimate you. Karlak, the Archdevil Zeriel's gladiator, come to burn the Sword Coast to ash. If by met you mean hoofing it through the hells with this fucker on my tail. <laughs> Shut it, devil. I know your kind. A heart darker than a shadow's nightmares. You'd cut a child's throat just to taste the blood. A devil. I didn't take the blade for a fool. I'm... A great fire roars through you. The fire of the first hell. You are Karnak, tearing through demons across a blood-red landscape of fire and volcanic cinder. The front lines of the blood war. With every swing of her axe, Karlak fulfills Mistress Zariel's purpose. Proof! Clear as summer sky! It's over, Karlak. It's time you feel the sting of the blade. I've tried to tell you. I'm not what you think I am. Another vision. Karlak's blade rays slicing through devils, Zariel's servants, as her eyes dart around, seeking escape. Will shudders with Karlak's desperation. She is a victim of the blood war, not an agent of it. 
By Baldurin's helm, I... No, I will not be tricked. You saw the truth. I may be an effective soldier, but I never wanted to serve Zariel. Legged it away from her the first chance I got. And yet you served. No! Devils cannot be trusted! You know monsters better than anyone. Can't you look in my eyes and see I'm not a devil? You don't know what this means. You don't know what you're asking me to do. I'm asking you to live, Will. I don't want to hurt you. And to be frank, I'd rather not find out how the Blade got his name. I swear to you, on all I am, I am not what you think. Shit! Shit. You really are no devil, are you? I've... I've been deceived. Oh, thank the gods. I thought I was gonna have to take your head. <laughs> you would have died in the attack. But there have been enough threats today. Truce then, eh? Aye. Truce. I see the good in you, Karlak. I promise not to lose sight of it. Even when the hells burn hottest. Well, I'm glad they made up. What's up for discussion? Ah. Oh. Another. Thy name has been recorded. I shall be here in thy camp for whenever thou hast need of my services. A mending of the threads between life and death. Should thou or any of thy compatriots perish, I will cleave soul to body once more. A matter of 200 coin. bucks and he brings people back from the dead and he can help change class bro this seems like this is kind of critical that you can just miss the homie that allows you respects and everything else I'm also debating on changing classes for well, let me let me figure out who I want to keep first cuz I could give her a different barbarian build. Or do I want do I want the wild barbarian or do I want like berserker barbarian? I'm pretty sure he changes class of any character. Let me see. Ah, oh, I shall be here in my camp. For whenever thou hast need of my services. So, if I look at the various subclasses. See, so this is where I could... I could change things up. So, right now, she's Wild Heart. Or no way, is she Wild Heart or Wild Magic? I think she's Wild Heart. Wild Heart, yeah. So she could be Wild Magic, which is like Barbarian Spin the Wheel. And she just gets crazy abilities. Or I can make a Berserker where she just claps cheeks. All the time. At any moment. And then as for Warlock Man, he can be Arc Fey, Fiend, or Great Old One. And then Cleric can be Knowledge, Life, Light, Nature, Tempest, Trickery, or War. Um, the Fighter Lady I'm not going to keep, but she could be Battlemaster, Eldritch Knight, or Champion. Who will be a dedicated tank if she's the damage dealer? We don't need a dedicated tank. We have two.
Berserker, Wild Heart, Wild Magic. I kind of wish I could like see what type of skills they all have. Let me see. So Berserker, straightforward, simple, big damage. Wild Heart, more versatility and control. Wild Magic is unpredictable, magic based. Yeah, well that's the thing with Shadow Heart. Trickery Domain blows. Definitely ain't doing that. If the wild magic barbarian causes wild magic surges, they could kill your party. Wild is the fiend. Fiend granted special Dark One's blessing, temporary health upon killing an enemy. Great Old One focuses more around necrotic damage, psychic damage whenever they miss them with an attack. Arc Fey, wild magic table for barbarian is much smaller and much less detrimental. Your party than a wild magic sorcerer. Well, I think for now, the big question, I'm probably going to want to keep her because I need somebody that can also do damage when abilities are on cooldown. So that's that's definitely a case. Um, I think I need to I think I just need to go do combat and really get a feel for Gale versus Will and see who I'm vibing with more. Cause I think, I mean, the more I think about the party, I feel like I have to have a cleric in it. Cause I don't think I'm gonna survive encounters otherwise, unless I'm like, you know, un unless there's, um, uh, what's it called? Um, Unless I get like an infinite short rest mod or something to just heal people constantly. I feel like I'm not going to survive fights without a cleric. I didn't while well, have two different things. Let me have repelling blast and it was something else I thought. Yeah, agonizing. Okay. Glad Will saw sense. Even more glad he decided to stick around. Takes a pretty slick mover to track down old Karlak. There's also other people. I mean, I could get the druid and rock the druid in the party, which druids have like crazy amounts of flexibility. Fair. <laughs> but still, the man's got a reputation for being lethal with that blade. I'm glad it's on our side.
Because I don't want my party to just be reliant on constantly doing long rests to get through encounters. I should speak up. You've been witness to a pantomime, I'm sorry to say. And I've played my part all too poorly. It means that a reckoning's coming. And I'll be the one to pay up. One night soon, when we make camp, the veil will be lifted, and I'll pay my penance. You're not in any danger, I promise. I can't say the same about me. I mean, it seems like she's, she's pretty pure damage right now. She can just heal herself. But I could make her a berserker. I mean, we can let's pull it, I guess. No, you, there is a bard class, but I think it's only if you make it yourself. I don't think there's a NPC bard. Damn, it's a lot of people leaning towards Berserker. And yeah, I think the druid that we rescue from the uh, from the goblins, I'm almost positive he can join your party. The companions, let's see, there are ten companions. Asterion, who we already got, our rogue, Gale, Laziel, the fighter, Shadowheart, Wile, Zarlok, Halzen is a druid, and then there's a paladin, a ranger, and then another druid that we can get, so you could have double druids. Let's see. Uh, subclasses. Druid has land, moon, and spores. Spore druid. I actually thought about doing spore druid. Straight turning this shit into Last of Us. Fucking <laughs> mushrooming up everybody. Not this one. Nor this one. Right. They. That's the man I'm just trying to respect. Oh, what the fuck? I can turn her ass into a bard? Automatically, hang on. No. Fate. Does thou require a new ally? Maybe I can't change the subclass. A resurrection instead. Thou require an as the and I can change her stats around too. I don't see how to change the uh, I don't see how to change the subclass. Where do we how do we change subclass though?
Oh, but we're in the level up screen. I didn't see it there. See, so specialization. Chosen subclass. There we go. Okay. Class Berserker. That's what we wanted. Now she just unga bungas everything. That's what we wanted. Looking ahead. I like bugged out her portrait though. Everybody takes a nap. How do we fix her fucking portrait, though? That's weird. Yeah, my cape is badass, though. So now she just unga bungas people. At least things have stayed interesting. Best be on my way. Me and the Tiefling Mommy I pulled by being a dragon. Stop coming up with anime titles for my adventure. I don't suppose you have any clue where we are in relation to water. In this distance between elves. They alone. Keep that beast away from us, you hear? Me the beast. Now that's fucking rich. Back, beast, back! Lady, I'm trying to trade with you. Let's march. On my way. Back, beast, back. She's not even in the party. One day I'll catch a break. Please, no more. Leave us in peace and we shall leave you in kind. Cut the crap, Anders. I know what you are. Don't let her hurt us. Please. We just want to go home. Big money, no whammies. when we return with Karlak's head on a pike. Zariel? Certainly not. We serve Tyr, Lord of Justice, no other. You dare. Half of us are bound dare to try to speak of justice in front of me. Ambushed you. The Arbiter of Vengeance. And with your flames, you proved us right. But Tyr will not consign us to our death. He is merciful. Leave us, and we'll leave you. Enough. Enough. I'll not play pretend. The was never my home. It was... Arrow of lightning. That looks like it fucking hurts. Take the might of the Inquisitors. Death won't take me yet. Smite! That's a juicy hit.
How do you like the cloud of daggers? This is my time. How do you like double cloud of daggers? Double the daggers! <laughs> They're fucked, dude. They're, su <coughs> They're super fucked. I was hoping to shove her out of the concentration. How about we light you on fire? Eldritch Blast! Damn. Critical miss. Oh no. She is saving on all of these throws. Bro, shit, this is an insane hold. Die. Three. Fuck them. Fuck Thoriel. I won't go back. I'm never coming back. And if any of Mummy's little friends want to pick up where the others left off, they weren't going to interact with me, so I, I couldn't sell my items. I would have had to leave Karlak at base, and then travel here, and then sell, and then go back to base, and then get Karlak. That's, that's a pain in the ass. Not big enough. Now get out before you get hurt. Now! Damn, bro, we're getting fucking cooked. What the fuck? He died. Always makes my day better. What the shit? Hold up. All right. That's, that's kind of crazy. I need to, I'm going to need to loot those bodies before, uh, shit goes down. Because she's like, I'm going to burn this whole place down. But would it make sense to leave her at base and then loot every, like, maybe, maybe I should do that. Because I can, yeah, hold up. 
Alright, here's what we're gonna do. This is this is a lot. I know, I know. Really? Oh. I know, I know. You don't want to, but I need to just leave camp. You're an impressive fighter game. You should consider a new name. I take it you have some suggestions. The wizard wonder. Or how about the master of the week? Tempting. But I think we might already have the maximum number of theatrical titles. All right, now we're gonna talk to you. Supplies? We've fewer mouths to feed now. Okay. Sell all the wares. In Tia's name. Now we're gonna hey, do soldier. that. And then we're gonna take back everything. Let's go. In peace. Okay. Cut the crap, Anders. I know what you are. Don't let her hurt us. Best foot forward. Put him there. Desire. Step by step. Put him here. All right, because now they're going to group up, and I'm just going to tear them apart. <clears throat> And then, well, actually, let's close this door so she has to, like, waste the time opening it. There we go. Please, we thought you would, but Tear will not consign us to our... I think the double cloud of daggers might be overkill. Damn, this ain't going well at all, bro. The fuck? Hold up. No. Fuck that. That's some bullshit. Dude, missing shit left and right. Okay, so back to camp, grab her. Hey, soldier. Suppose you've any clue where we are. Yeah, right? Almost one shot. That was ridiculous. These boots have seen everything. From this distance between Alter and Alder's gate. Please, no more. Leave us in peace and we shall leave you in kind. Two steps at a time. One with the weave. Mm, that way. 
what's down there? Gods! The salt on the nostrils should be labeled a war crime. While everyone is talking, we're just gonna do a little looting. Anything else down here? Could be interesting. Oath of looting. Been a chill day and enjoying the BG3 stream. Keep on smiting in the name of vengeance. I will, thank you. Okay. Please, we thought you but tear will not consign us to our death. Enough! The furnace will Ooh, got a reaction hit. They're dead on their next turn. What? Invisible? Get this bullshit out of here. What the fuck? Bro, what? What? Why? What is happening, dude? Why is my guy one-shotting people in my party? I know what you are. Don't let her hurt us. Please. We just plead. We thought the tear will not consign us to our death. It the fun Well, the first time we beat his ass, but then I, I died to all the fucking fires that started happening. Alright, something, something ain't right here. Something ain't fucking right. The other thing I don't get is before... My my paladin went first. I had initiation. 
and now I don't like I don't get it. I don't get why now all of a sudden Cuz that's what, before I hit him with smite and then he was basically dead. And now that's not happening. Now they're getting Yeah, maybe I need to to do the second cloud. Or I like. Here's what we're gonna do. Checking things out. Lost in thought to new horizons. Not a problem. Here's how this is going to go down. First, we got to reload all of his shit. God, this is sort of a nothing to label the war crime. Vault door. We're going to come back down for that. I'm gonna bust that vault open and get their goodies. Get fucked, idiots. Let's get going. Seems simple enough. Should mind my step. Damn it. So there's got to be a way to get into the vault. I can't. It's considered a... Oh no, I can. I can get through it. How do we open the hidden passage? Hmm. What's 
inside. Chat, any ideas? This is where the good stuff is. You think the chair? There was a click. What? Oh, we need, we need, there's two chairs. Okay, okay, hold up. We're gonna... Poison, but it's okay. We're a dragon. A toxin. No, wait. Damn, that toxin does hurt. Shit, I see it now. Okay. You ready for the big brain? You ready? Ready for the big brain moves? Here's what we do. We cannot pass the perception check. But, through the power of rewind, we know that the trap is there. And therefore, we can jump over it. <laughs> Wish I had a bag of holding. Need to find a way forward. Look at all this stuff. needs to be done. Give it a shot. I wonder if I could just straight slap him in the face to get things started. No, we ain't gonna die. We quick saved it. We're good. Please, no more. Don't let her hurt us. The tear will not consign us to our death. He is. You do not hit today. If rage turns into a frenzy, frenzied strike and rage throw, you can also make improvised weapon action as a bonus action. Alright, so now that she's frenzied...
can't hit both of them. I could grease them so they can't move. Kind of worked. Did you see that? Smited the fuck out of him. Give me your loot, you broke bitch. See, this is one of the things with this game, is like... When, you, when you're able to prep before a fight, it's like a complete 180. Like, you could be getting your ass beat, and then you prep, and you're like, Yep, this is how it goes down. You're all fucking dead. That was fucking vent. You're gonna, we're just gonna save right now, because that was fucking vengeance. These boots have seen everything. God, I'm so close, so close. They rolled seven. Okay. Yeah, you can hold me. You're not gonna be able to escape. How about some Eldritch Blast? I gotta find the invisible person. Shit, I didn't even think about looting the whole house. Oh, that'll throw them. you pretty hard, didn't they? Indeed. Oh, what the fuck was that? What the shit? Hold up. She just did some some bullshit. So Dube was smited, and then she was getting ready to come in. You know what? Here's what we're going to do. It fucked, idiot. And now she tries to open that door, we're just going to be like waiting. We're just going to wait to smite the shit out of her. She did it again! Bro, what? She comes in and she throws a bomb. Is there any way I can avoid getting bombed? Okay. <laughs> I don't know if I can still close it. Let's see. 
Let's see what happens. Damn, it still hits me. I think I think that's the right strat though. I need to figure out the play here, the gimmick. There's got to be There's got to be a uh We're going to box her ass in so she can't move. This is sketchy. Welcome to D and D. Get the fuck out. <laughs> Swift as my feet can carry me. Alright. <laughs> that's, that, that's gotta work. She's invisible, but she's stuck back there. She's invisible, but she is stuck. Damn, it was still a critical miss. Death is but a word away. Shoop shoo. Okay, now. Damn, I lose health and I fall down making that jump? Shit. Light on my feet. See, the question now... So... We got her boxed in, but what do we do? She's she's back there and she's invisible. And when I approach, she's probably going to throw a bomb. She's still back there. <laughs> we just leave. We just we just leave and she never gets to do anything. She stays there forever. I love that her ass is still stuck back there. I don't know what happens if I leave. think here do I do I create a poison surface do I just grease and fireball because if I grease and fireball she's gonna escape
let's save before we do this. Frosty services can knock them prone. That can poison them. Saved simple toxin. Yeah, well, you're going to be sitting back there for a bit, so have fun with that. Let's see what she does. She jumped out. She's running. Wait, holding me doesn't stop. Damn, she level four too? Okay. Um, I don't see the thing is this is but th this is my situation like if I if I didn't I would love to do cloud of daggers, but then I've used up one of my level two spell slots That's my problem. I really I need a mod where like I'm not expending spell slots constantly Because I already know like I don't care if that's against the rules. I would have so much more fun like being like, oh, I'm gonna, you know, grease into Cloud of Daggers, now I'm gonna do this, and then this. Like, I'd rather use spells per situation instead of being like, oh, well, I only have two, and I only get one per long rest, do I, do I want to use that right now? Because that's the problem, right now I'm like, I don't want to, you know, I don't, I'm a, I, I don't want to use certain spells. No, this one, look, this one says... Level 2 spell slot. Level 2 spell slot. Replenishable. Used to cast spells. Recharge. Once per long rest. So if it's a short rest thing, it's not until later. So I get fucking 6 casts total before I have to take a long rest. I'll look into mods after the stream. Let's... That's the play. Oh, she's fucked. My cantrips aren't that strong. I get I know cantrips, but then I'm just using like fucking fire. Wonder if the gods are watching me. Oh shit. Oh. 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 <laughs> Big fucking nap time. Get in that corner. Right in her eye. Oh. She's probably going to bomb again. Unless we hit her in the face with Eldritch Blast! She did. We got to go. We gotta go, everybody up. Nope, everybody up. Everybody up before she burns the whole fucking place down. See, now I gotta... Oh man, I wish I could have a bigger party. I wonder if there's a mod for that. Because the only thing this party is missing is a cleric. And if I could have a cleric on top of the party I have right now, I'd be very happy with that. 
Like, Warlock, I mean, five five person party sounds good. That's another mod I'm gonna look into. I bet there's one. I have the sword. I have the sword. What is this? Drow poison? Ooh, cool. Is it better though? 6 to 16 versus 6 to 19. This is a 2d6 plus 4. This is a 2d6 plus 3. But I have a 1d4 fire. But the words deliverance, justice, vengeance are engraved in the base of the sword. That is kind of, it's almost like it was made for me. Five to 16. Maybe I give her the fire sword and then I use the justice sword. No, I did loot it this time. It's, it's here. That's it. And then I can feed this to Gale at a later time. Tears of Blessing. Increase its armor class by two. Discussion. Gail, you need to like gobble some potions up. A little steam after facing off with those ignots. Granted, the fire lasted a little longer than it should. Hear that? Infernal engine for a heart. Let's me burn as hot as the hells. Seems to be running in overdrive since I left Avernus. Won't be seeing my mechanic anytime soon, so I'll just make the most of the extra heat. Just don't get too close, till I've found a way to calm it down. Burn, baby. As hot as I can tolerate. Makes me a beast in battle. Hardly remember what I was like before it. But it's a bit early in the game to be getting into tragic backstories. Let's save the Scar Show for later, after we've worked up an appetite for tragedy. Meanwhile, I'll need to find someone who can tune up my engine sooner rather than later. Believe me when I say this thing is hot. The first time I faced down those paladins, they let slip there was an infernal mechanic in the area. A tiefling. He might be able to stabilize things, if I can find him. Sounds like a good lead. Hopefully our guy will be among them. A tune-up would do this old tub a world of good. Yeah, I'm definitely going to look for a uh, increased party capacity mod. Because that would be super useful, just to have... Uh... Very well. That's my thing, I'm so torn on the party. If I could just add a cleric, so then I have like my warlock, my wizard, my paladin, my barb, my cleric, I'd be... I could... I could be, I'd be happy with that. Might be useful. And then I also might do something where... I don't know. I want to look into a mod where I don't use up spell slots and one where I can short rest more often so I'm not constantly fucking dying. Yeah, I'll take it. Anything of use? Well, you have wizards, warlocks, and sorcerers. They all play pretty different. Let's have a party of 12, one of each class. That would make encounters kind of a shit show, to be honest. With that many people? See, I don't, I don't think a five party would be that bad. I think the, the most I would do would be like six. I think past six, I think the party's getting a little, little too full. 
Uh, plenty of other games similar to Baldur's Gate that has a party member is more than four. Yeah, no, if I don't I don't think five people would be broken. I mean there's mods for divinity that let you have bigger parties, so. But otherwise Will is just gonna be fucking on the verge of death all the time. See, if I heal him again, there goes my spell slots. And then if, since I used up those spell slots, not gonna be able to smite at all. I also gotta figure out how to fix Carlock's uh, portrait. That was weird. When we respect her, it bugged out her portrait. I'm supposed to go heal. How do, is there a fast travel? Average party size in D&D 5e is four or more, and you can have as little as one, so five is not broken at all. Exactly. Five is fine. Let's let's talk to, to Nettie, just because it's like a plot thing. Cheat Engine is more for, like, temp fixes. This is, I would want, like, a mod that does something like this. Because I don't feel like having to boot boot up cheat engine every time I want to play the game. All we need is this spell slot replenishment short rest or like something like spell slots replenish on short rest and then add like a infinite short rest mod or something. The thing is, these games are so fucking, I mean, it's, it, you know, very much like Divinity, where, uh, like, if you're going into combat not healed up, you're probably fucking dead. It's very easy for shit to go sideways really fast in these games. I'm sure there's some people that are like rushing ahead. We're we're st we're still in like early access right now. I see you. Just give me a moment. There, it's up to her now. Life or death. Now, what was it you needed? I do what I can. For most folks, that's enough. Come here. Let's have a look at you. You seem healthy enough. A bit tired around the eyes, maybe. A tadpole. A mind flare tadpole. I, uh, I'll do what I can. Doesn't Come, she try to... Follow me. I might be able to help. Doesn't she, like, try to betray me and kill me? This way. I think she tries to kill me. Almost positive she attacks me in, like, half a second here. This one had the same problem as you. Attacked us in the woods together with some goblins. Tadpole crawled out of his head soon after. I'll do the best I can. 
I'm no Master Halson mine. He'd have your tadpole out like that. Still, we have options. All right. Let's see what we can do. She shifts uneasily, hesitating. Something's off. It might. But first things first. Tell me about your symptoms. Have you noticed anything strange happening? I'm telling you everything you need to know. Believe me on that. I want to help you. But I can't unless you work with me. So, has anything unusual happened to you? Victims can identify each other. Not that the others know they're victims, of course. How do you pick up the parasite? Halson was desperate to find where all this was happening. A mind flare ship? But Master Halson was sure. Look, you've been straight with me, so I'll be straight with you. You're dangerous. If you transform here, we're all dead. But you seem like a good soul. You deserve a chance to save yourself. This is a vial of wyvern poison. Swear to me, you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. Swear it. I hope it doesn't come to that, but thank you. Here. You know, I've spent my life treating folk and never once saw a mind flare infection. Then suddenly, there's dozens of you. Maybe more. Master Halson and I were tracking them, studying them, trying to figure out what the hell was going on. Because you should all be changing. There should be a small army of mind flayers out there. But you're not. Weird powers aside, you seem perfectly normal. For one, that thing in your head is like nothing we've ever seen from Mind Flayers. It's one of their worms for sure. But this one gives you powers. Telepathic connections. And it doesn't turn you into one of them. Not yet, anyhow. Hard to say. But there's a lot we don't know. Infected, folks like you, have been converging on an old temple of Saluna. And I've no idea why. When Master Halson heard the adventurers were heading that way, he saw a chance to get answers. Joined on the spot. Whatever he found there, he didn't make it back. I think so. I hope so. I've sent birds to find him, but they can't get close without goblins trying to shoot them down. You, though, you're one of them. Technically speaking, I mean. They won't kill someone carrying their parasite. If you can find Halson and get him out of there, we can discover what he learned. And perhaps he can save your life. How's that sound? Thank you. It would mean everything to the Grove. To me. I wish I could tell you more. But only those adventurers know what happened out there. All I can say for sure is they all went to the old temple of Saluna. And Master Halson did Saving Private Hazel. Good luck out there. And if things start to go bad, remember the vial. Remember your oath. Oh, she didn't try to kill me. Why the poison? I'm putting it on a weapon. Smacking somebody with it. And if it comes to a fight, you'll not shy away from bloodshed, I hope. Since when did we become killers? Since they forced our hand. Alright, let's go... Is this the way out? Yeah. We're gonna go by the merchant, sell everything. 
We're gonna see if there is a infernal mechanic, and then I think that's a good spot to wrap things up. So it's almost time for me to go get the wee lad from school. I have enough time to look for some mods. I should speak up. My guy looks badass with his cape. Need anything else? Of course, but please remember, you're not the only one in need. We don't even know these people. That doesn't matter. Of course it does. You would choose strangers over us. That's not what I said. Can you stop shouting? No? Hmm. All right, good trades. Sylvanas be with you. Calm down, please. I won't leave them behind. You're going to get us killed. Um, add to the wares. Fair amount of shit to sell. Sell that later, though. All right, uh, let's see. Goblin. Let's go talk to uh, Captain Bro. If anybody knows about an infernal mechanic, he might. Time grows short. If Korga won't abandon her madness, then we'll have to try the road, goblins or no. What is it? Hmm. You're the one who helped at the gate. Chad, who should we talk to? Maybe the blacksmith? Thought I sensed an inferno around here. But you aren't from Elturel. What's your story? I spent a good bit of time in the hells. Enlisted against my will by the Archdevil Zariel. Same as you, I suppose, if you're from Elturel. The devils were delighted when your city was swallowed up. I thought they had you for keeps. Glad you got out. I got lucky. It looks like you did too. And... You brought some infernal machinery with you. A little gift from Zariel. Keeps me burning hot. Very hot by the smell of it. Might be burning out a piston ring or leaking oil. Mind if I take a listen? Be my guest. But don't get too close or your eyes will melt shut. Phew! You really are burning up. Whoever put that engine together tried to house metallurgized demano valves inside a Ragnax alloy casement. 
very risky. I might be able to help them, but I'd need infernal iron and a prayer that my hammer will survive the work. That thing isn't meant to operate outside of Vernus. I'm not sure how much longer it'll keep running the way it's going. Will you be able to turn down the temperature a little? Worried I'm gonna go in for a handshake and singe someone's arm off one of these days. I'd worry about surviving the night first. But help one, help both. If we can cool you off, it'll stabilize your engine and allow you to touch whomever you please. I've sensed some during our travels. It has a, a pull to it. Absolutely magnetic, once you know what you're looking for. I can show you where I'd look. Meanwhile, I've still got plenty of weapons and armor in stock if you're looking to load up. I think I want to get the iron for her heart before I worry about the goblins or uh, Aslan. Just because I feel like she's, uh, I, I don't think I'm leaving her out of the party. She seems like a fun character. Use your gold, you're rich. There's nothing I need. All the armor is kind of mid. Uh, either way, we're going to wrap things up here. This looks like a good stopping point before we head on out on another adventure. Actually, we'll get through the gate first, just so we don't got to wait for that at the start of the next stream. Um, I'm going to look into some mods, because, like, having a... Adding a fifth person as an cleric to the party, that would be dope. Because that, that's my thing. I'm like, <clears throat> where I'm at, I just... I can't decide who I want to be the fourth. If I can have a five-person party, I'm set. Because I might drop one of my casters for the Druid, but then I would have, like, my Barb, my Cleric, a caster, a Druid, and then my dude. So, I'm going to look into mods a little bit. Uh, we'll wrap up here. I might do another stream of this later tonight. I don't know if we have plans or not this evening, but if I do, it'll be, like, 7, 8 p.m. Uh, but for now, at least, we'll wrap on up. So, you have a good day.